Hey guys, it's TNN and today we're going to have a look at some Bluetooth earphones. Now we've looked at many Bluetooth earphones, but these are the Soundpeats QY8 Bluetooth earphones and let's go ahead and unbox and review it. So as always, link to buy will be down below in the description. So let's have a look at the box over here. It's a nice box, usually found similar boxes on Soundpeats, they're all very nice boxes. We've got QY8, Soundpeats, Android iOS. On the side we have 5 hours talk time, 5 hours music time, 175 hours standby time and 10 meters range, which is really nice. On the back we have the Soundpeats email address, we've got some diagrams of the device, Bluetooth version 4.1, high, fidelity and stereo music, 6th gen CVC noise reduction, that's it. Let's go ahead and cut open the seal on the top and and I failed I completely failed cutting it open but I think we got in there now or did I fail again yeah I did fail again what am I doing I don't even know how to cut a seal yeah do there you go it makes sense if I put the blade the right way around yeah so let's go and get this out of the box so as you can see straight away it comes with the carry case now mainly all sound peats earphones usually come with this carry case it's a really really nice carry case I have to say so we have the basic user manual of how to turn on the device how to put the clips in what it comes with what not if you're new to Bluetooth earphones you could probably go ahead and read that but Soundpeach usually make very similar earphones with very similar ways to use them so let's go ahead and open up this pouch really really nice pouch hard quality very small as well easy to put away so we have and one case is like these ear things like a little attachment to attach it into your ear everyone has different ear sizes so it's to make more comfortable again some more ear pods the little pod bits for your ear and also some clips as well great to have various sizes extra small small medium and large we also have another clip to attach to your shirt really nice that sound pits give all of this with the devices now we have the main thing to charge the device is a flat quality micro USB to USB cable with really nice high quality you can tell instantly but the main device we're looking at here is the earphone so I'm gonna go ahead and pack this up so I went to go pack that up clear it up and let's look at the earphones so I have to say they do look fairly big they're about the same size as my thumb so they're quite big earphones but they look okay I wouldn't say they're the best looking earphones but they're mainly targeted at fitness and usually domestic sort of earphones so I can tell instantly we have a button on here with the Soundpeats logo feels quite high quality I have to say and we will go ahead and review this I'm going to use it for a few days or so but the materials feel really high quality and robust I have to say and even the flat cable all around so I'm going to go ahead and use this and we will check it out in the review but so far so good So let's go ahead and review it. Right, so I've used it for a few days now and have to say, really, really nice earphones. But I do have a few problems. So the first problem, well actually it's one problem, not many problems, but first problem is the design. And we'll get to that in just a bit. So we have a really nice flat cable all around. The earphones are actually surprisingly comfortable. Really, really lightweight. I have to say it's unbelievably light. So let's look at the left ear first and that's where the first problem is so we have a micro USB charging port which I cannot open so I'm gonna go ahead and do it off camera and we'll be right back I cannot open it at all yep let's go eventually okay so I just managed to open it it took so long to open it. it's unbelievable and and I closed it again great anyway nothing amazing in there it's just a micro USB port it takes about one hour to charge the device and the device lasts for about five hours music time which is it's pretty good I mean it's pretty decent it's just the annoying thing is that they really had to put that tab there and that cover and that's so annoying I cannot do it I cannot open it at all it's very irritating and that's the only issue I have the main issue other than that it's really nice device I have to say so this is the left one with the micro USB port as you can see it says left on the corner there 
uh, comfort wise it's actually really comfortable it's really lightweight really nice it does quite fit in well but not as well as you expect so i wouldn't really advise to use it for running because it probably would fall out of your hair so we have the button on and off button here and also the pairing button on the right earphone here we have again the attachment to attach it properly into your ear so it fits into the shape now we have the volume up button and the volume down button which also act as next song and previous song so if you click and hold the volume up button it goes into the next song click and hold the volume down button it will go into the previous song and I have to say these buttons do work really really well so let's go ahead and actually turn it on so this is also an LED light as well to indicate whether it's on or whether it's in pairing mode now it may be hard to see but I think you can just about see it but the whole Sound Pete's logo does light up which is really, really nice I really like that idea and it looks ultra ultra cool so there you go when you click and hold it goes into pairing mode and then it flashes blue and red after that it's so simple to pair your phone literally just go on your smartphone go on settings go on bluetooth go on search for device and once it's on the sound peach qi8 go ahead and click on it and that's it you're paired it's as simple as that so just so ahead it would be called sound peach qi8 and just click on that and you're paired and this other than that then you start playing some music and you realize instantly these are some great earphones now i'm going to say looks wise aesthetically it doesn't look that amazing but it is really lightweight and comfortable to wear i really do like that design actually i have to say but i tried a shake test and it did slip out a little bit from the ear and especially when i'm using it and i use the buttons it's not really well fitted into your ear so when you're using the buttons it does sometimes jiggle about or and fall off sometimes but again that's maybe just my ear or the force that i use you know everyone's different so it depends on the person you are so i don't really go for earphones like these especially if they're for sports so i would use this for domestic you know just listening to normal music at home but they are quite comfortable i have to say for you know domestic use but for using it in sports it's not very good and that's the only one issue i have there is that micro usb port i really wondered why did they put that tab there because i cannot open it at all i have to use a pin or something to open it up but sound quality wise let's go into the sound quality now very very nice sound quality very crisp very detailed it has the background noises it picks them all up it cancels any outside noises as well now i have reviewed sound Pete's earphones before those can be found in the description down below so which ones are these uh, i think they're the q9a yeah so i have reviewed sound Pete's earphones as well so you can check these ones out on the top over here and these are also really nice earphones I have to say and we've got the other ones here you can check these Soundpeats earphones out again you can go and click on the card on top over here and check them out as well now I have to say Soundpeats I'm so happy with Soundpeats they really really make good quality sound really really nice earphones and even with the QY8 again very great earphones bass is absolutely amazing it gets really really loud i mean i was impressed at how loud it could get it gets pretty loud and sound quality doesn't change even when it gets loud it's really really nice so as always linked above down in the description don't forget to comment like subscribe share this video and as always thanks for watching but just before we go one little thing i'd like to say is i'm going to do like a poll sort of thing go ahead and answer the question above up over here on the top right and tell me which earphones you think look the best